Reds and Indians at Great American Ballpark, the site of the 2015 All-Star Game, and there is the good-looking logo to prove it. Let's pick it up bottom two. It is Danny Salazar at a two-on-two-out jam as he faces Zach Cozart. Hit pretty good on the left field line. If it's fair, say goodbye. Off the pole, it's a homer for Cozart, and the Reds take a 3-0 lead. So a good start for the Reds in this one on the hill for Cincy is Matt Latos. And leading up the third inning is Jan Gomes. He sends this one to short. Elevating is Cozart to bring that one down. Nice play by Cozart. A pretty good couple of innings for him. And Latos is all smiles, and why not? Now we go bottom four. It is Chris Negron at the plate as he faces Salazar with a man on. Hit pretty good. Left center field. Gone back. Warning track. Wall. It is gone. Negron did it again. And watch him tour the bases. Boy, is he taking advantage of this chance. That makes it 5 0 Reds. We go back to Latos in the fifth. And following that delivery to Nick Swisher, Latos with some discomfort in his throwing hand. And that's the hand the trainers check on, but Latos would stay in the game. And later in the inning, with one on and two men away, pinch hitter Chris Dickerson goes down. Top six, one on and one away from Michael Brantley. That's an easy twin killing to end the frame. And then top seven, it is Swisher who goes down on the call third strike. And the Indians lineup on Wednesday was largely Latos intolerance. Now a 6-0 game, bottom seven. It is second and third, two men away for Todd Frazier facing Mark Zepchinski, and Frazier sends it down the line, a two-run double. You get the idea. Reds go on for the 8-3 win behind Latos as he gives up three runs over seven to two-thirds for his fourth victory of the season. Zach Cozart's second inning home run was his first long ball since June 1st. Danny Salazar, meanwhile, saw his three-start winning streak snapped after yielding five runs through just four innings.